हेलो डियर फ्रेंड्स एट द आउटसेट थैंक यू वेरी मच फॉर सपोर्टिंग माय चैनल ग्रामीफिकेशन होप द कंटेंट्स आर यूजफुल फॉर यू प्लीज डोंट स्किप द वीडियो इन बिटवीन एंड वॉच टिल द एंड एज आई एम गोइंग टू गिव यू फ्यू ट्रिक्स ऑन द स्मार्ट यूज ऑफ डब्ल्यू एच वर्ड्स इफ यू हैव मिस्ड एनी ऑफ माई प्रीवियस वीडियोज then click check the i button above and the link is provided below so here we are with the other words of wh family so here we are with what what is called as the most flexible word of wh family as it can be used in varieties of ways for example what is your name my name is so and so or i am so and so what is your place of birth my place of birth is delhi or i am from delhi as you can find out that in the very first sentence it is a simple question but in the second sentence what is used to find out the place what sometimes used to find out the object also for example what do you eat i eat rice i eat chapati etc next word is where where is used to find the place place includes city town country direction etc for example where do you live i live in bhubneswar where do you live i live in the north east corner of the town next word is when when is used to find out the time time includes clock time date day month year century parts of day like morning evening afternoon parts of is including childhood young age old age etc for example when are you coming i am coming on sunday i am coming in january i am coming at dinner time have you marked the differences between on sunday in january and at dinner time just think why these three words are used at the end of this video i am going to answer why it is being used how how is used to find out the detail of any of the action for example how you solved this answer the answer is i solved by using this trick i solved in this way or that way if someone is asking how you fell down you are telling that i was going on this direction or that direction then i heard a sound i stepped on the banana peel out and i fell down so how is used to a long briefing answer what where when how when used as a pronoun is followed by auxiliary verb auxiliary verb includes is am are has have had do did does will shall would etc followed by the subject and the rest for example what do you eat how did you complete the task in time when will you come home etc our next word is which as we all know that which is used to select a non living object from a group of non living similar type of objects for example which is your pen when so many pens are there in one place but i am going to share the rarest of the rare use of which you may not find it in any of the video lecture or in very few books it can be used in the case of living objects also let us see with an example
For example, for example, there are two engineers sitting and you are not sure who is working for Google. In this case, you may ask which of you work for Google. This type of use is very very rare kind of use of which. Our next word is why. Why is used to find out the reason behind any of the action. For example, why you are late. So the person who is answering will explain the reason. Why are you biting your nails? The person will tell the reason behind it. So this is the end of our WH word. But while discussing when we were talking about the use of on, at and in. So let us see what is the answer or why it is used. At is used for specific time like at 5 o'clock, at sunrise, at dinner. In is used for a long time period like in January, in summer season, in old days etc. And on is used for day and date Sunday, Monday like 24th January etc. The above is called as the preposition of time. Preposition we are not going to discuss in detail right now. This is the end of WH interrogatives. Few of my students had asked me about the rules of changing affirmative sentences into negative one as well as negative sentences into affirmative one. And they had even asked me one question like Ram is a bad boy whether it is an affirmative sentence or a negative sentence. So my next video I will prepare on affirmative and negative sentence and how it can be converted into one and the other. Thank you very much for your patience watching and listening. Thank you and have a nice day.